Dolby gave me $25,000 to make my short film, Sirens. Here's how I spent it. Equipment was by far our biggest expense. We spent just under $10,000 on renting camera equipment, heavily discounted rate, lighting equipment, heavily discounted rate, and four solid state hard drives to back up the footage twice. Our next expense was talent. We spent $1,750 on hiring three actors for two full days. Our next expense was crew. Now myself, my producer, my DP, my gaffer, my PAs, my crafty manager, my wardrobe stylist, they all went without rate. But we were able to pay our grip, our swings, our ACs, our camera op, and the makeup artists at a very heavily discounted rate. Having all those bodies on set, we needed crafty. We fed 25 people three meals a day for two full days. Next is locations. Now, I wrote a film that was heavily inspired by a specific place, and because of that, I wanted to film in that exact place. Luckily, the Cuyahoga Valley National Park System allowed us to pay $750 a day to use their location and have permission to film anywhere on the grounds. As an editor myself, I was able to save some money by not having to pay post-production editor, but I did have to pay some licensing fees. We licensed four songs and one visual element. Next, we have lodging. We paid $1,000 in total to house out-of-town talent and crew. Originally, we spent just under $400 on wardrobe, but thanks to my wonderful wardrobe stylist, she was able to do some returns and it brought it down to about $300. I wanted to have pre-pro books on site for all department heads going to both days of production. And lastly, at $60.34, we have short-term production insurance, which gives us a grand total of $24,022.90.